Hi, and welcome to another edition of Ran On Location. And I was looking through my files, and I think I just posted a few pictures of what was going on. I think it was about a year ago when they were doing some road work on 2nd Street between Park and uh, Parcells. They actually just grinded down the road and exposed some of Pomona's past. Uh, the cobblestone bricks that you're going to see about the size of a bread loaf made out of granite uh, were uncovered while they were doing this. I got some really good close-up pictures of them and I even was able to take one of these uh, cobblestones, these bricks that you're going to see and I gave it to the uh, Pomona Historical Society and you can go over there and check it out and uh, see what it actually looks like and like I said it's about the size of a loaf of bread and these are what that Pomona used to have running down through the gutters or the streets many years ago. Now um, there is some pictures of these uh, uh, of the gutters and stuff but it's really hard to see in the old pictures of Pomona because they're not that clear but anyway that's what uh, these bricks are all about and like I said while they were doing some road work they uncovered these bricks. Now in the video I was talking about well maybe we can leave these exposed so everybody can enjoy them but you know what it's just best if what they did was just cover them back up and I figured if I could just get one brick uh, and then with pictures uh, take it over to the uh, Pomona Historical Society and they can display the brick to give uh, you people an idea of what the bricks look like instead of just looking at a picture like on this video so if you want to see the brick go over to the uh, Ebell Club, Pomona Historical Society, and check the brick out there, and they'll show you uh, where the brick's at on display. So anyway, let me go on and show you the pictures and video of what what they did, what they uncovered, uh, some of Pomona's history. And like I said, I'm glad that they did cover them back up that way. You know, they'll be protected. So anyway, here we go with the bricks. Yeah, hey, Ren here. I'm over here on 2nd Street, almost to the corner of Park Avenue. You know, while they're doing this road construction, they uncover quite a bit of uh, Pomona's past. Like, for instance, here in the rain gutter, these are old bricks that they used to use. And while they were uncovering or doing their road construction, they uncovered these bricks. It's too bad we couldn't save these and leave them exposed so the people can enjoy them but they go all the way down to Parcells okay it's hard to say if these were like came from a, a factory or brickyard like for instance Pomona Brickyard that used to be here in Pomona because they're all different sizes I was trying to see if there's any kind of markings on them to see uh, like where they came from but it's all on the south side of 2nd Street here and I looked across on the other side over there and it didn't have it but yeah it'd be something to save at least we know that they're here and they're not too messed up so maybe one of these days we can uh, bring them back out or Maybe we can try to save them now and leave them exposed so uh, we can uh, en enjoy the, some of the past here in Pomona. So anyway, I'll keep you updated on what might happen with these bricks, but like I said, at least we know that they're here. Okay, I want to get a real good close-up. I want to document this as much as I can because they're going to end up getting covered up again and at least we know that these bricks exist and maybe sometime later on when things get better around the city we can come back and expose these bricks.
Like I said, I tried to find some kind of riding, but I didn't see any, but they kind of resemble like homemade bricks. They're different sizes, as you can see. Well, there you have it. Now, the last picture uh, I put up was a picture of what it looked like back then when those uh, cobblestones or bricks were uh, down on the road there in Pomona back then. Now, this picture was taken between 1890 and 1895. So, it kind of gives you an idea of that, uh, what, what it did look like. And where you see that horse and buggy where it's parked, that's where those uh, cobblestones would be at, right alongside the curb there so the rainwater and everything else drain into the uh, whatever drain or whatever if they had drains back then <laughs> I don't know probably not if I just went out into a field but anyway that's what it looked like okay if anything should come up I'll get back with you uh, like any more come on a history being uncovered I'm always got my eye out okay so like always you take care, and you take care of those ones you love. Thank you. Thank you very much.